What's up guys? Small Sunday here. And welcome back to uh, Psycho Knots. Um yeah, I'm not sure what's going on today. I think I need to go further into the camp. I think I think we've done pretty much all we can do here. Oh, there's an arrowhead. But yeah, let's see if I can't get the second merit badge today. 17 arrowheads. Okay. Man, I wish I had the <laughs> Is he just mumbling over the loudspeakers? I think I'm pretty sure he is. Cheap today. <laughs> okay. Passing, but I need to get to Sasha Nine's secret lab. Maybe you should have thought of that before. Why do you have a neck brace? That That's why I'm here now. <laughs> now you gotta pay the toll. One arrowhead. Pay up. Oh no. Is that what you're talking about? Yep. That's an arrowhead. <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with you? An Indian burial ground and oh my gosh, Indians buried their dead here. Ew! <laughs> no, stupid. They buried their arrowheads here. Okay, They're that's cool. But they let out a little, just so like anyway. Yeah, I gave him one arrowhead. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, there you come here, you. Can't do the scavenger hunt without a list. Report back to me when you have enough items for your first promotion. Now get! <laughs> okay, so I gotta get a fertility idol, golden acorn, a dinosaur bone, a miner's, a miner's skull? That's fucked up, man. People's body parts? That's on the scavenger hunt? Cherrywood pipe, diver's helmet, like cherrywood is actually good for pipes. Diver's helmet, eagle claw, so we got people parts and animal parts. Pirate scope. There were pirates here. A Psychonauts comic, a condor egg, a fossil, a turkey sandwich, a voodoo doll, a glass eye, a gold doubloon. That's rare as fuck, man. And a gold watch. So where do I? Oh. Hey, where'd he go? He disappeared. Okay. I'll just wander around like a crit. There's the lizard again, and it disappears. Oh, I can move that. This is amazing. This is amazing. I don't know why this is so amazing. Just move my face into it. Well, a big promotion for the winner. For the winner. Oh, it's Hamburger Girl. Hey, it's the king of the obstacle course. Why don't you have any teeth? Awesome. And why do you have too you much teeth? Psychonaut by now. Yeah, or even a double psychonaut. That's the that's the goal. Wow. Those two are so nice. And Coach is still having a seizure or something. Oh, there's a band. Hey, why are you stopping? Oh, I thought you stopped. No, 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 no. Let's go. Is that a little boy or a little girl? <laughs> Drum solo. Woo! You heard the man. <laughs> The fire starters? That's, That's great. My bro. That's fucking great. From the part where I do that Is that thing? a reference to the prodigy? <laughs> hey, you guys are thanks, man. Hey, do you have a lighter? Cause and completely insensitive. Oh right, right. Oh no, <laughs> I forgot a do over. Two, fire three. bad. <laughs> what is that poster? Does that just say it just says careful and there's a crocodile? Eating a brain? That's awesome! It's just a crocodile eating a brain. <laughs> can I jump in this? I can jump in this. to the whispering rocket underground rapid transit system. Awesome. Would you like to go back to your private sanctuary now, Agent Krella? Or somewhere else? That's sexy. That's a sexy voice. <laughs> <laughs> Nowhere. I just like to come down here to hear your voice. Nowhere. I just like to come down here to hear your voice. <laughs> Any time, sir. <laughs> oh, that's pretty great. I love this game. This game is great. It's a what the? F it's the fucking bear. It scares the shit out of me. Fuck off. No, it's clawing me. I'm gonna fuck this bear up. Damn it, maybe it's gonna kill me. Nope, don't do it, bear. Grab the card. 
<laughs> so I had to go to Crawler's lab to put Psychors together. Good to know. Good to know. This bear is gonna kill me. Where'd it go? Oh, it's over there. I'm not, I'm not gonna fuck you. Get out of here, you fucker. It's just a fucking bear. You'd think that the camp counselors would help take care of that. A fucking bear mauling the kids? A psychic bear at that? You gotta think like pulling an arrowhead out of a rock? Even if you have mind powers, it can't be easy. What's going on? Oh, cutscene. Shit. Okay. <laughs> Was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. <laughs> mm. <laughs> it must have been something else. You Raz, you're a creeper. Scum. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. Watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Where's really? your nose? Who? You, tree sitter! <laughs> oh, okay. Good that it put me back where I belong. Back where I was. Oh, it's Fish Kid. Hello, like Fish fun. Kid. It's work. I'm testing a low orbit space plane design. How's the testing going? Not now, Raz. Then why, why do you you have a bow on? This kid's got a bow on. I can't tell if it's a little boy or a little girl. I honestly have no idea. I saw Mills peeking into a hole in the girl's cabin. <laughs> oh Mills. When would you peek into a hole in my heart? Uh-huh. What? I mean, he'd see my new boyfriend James staring back, and he'd be furious at Mills. Mills. Exactly. And Anyway, there wouldn't even be a hole because James fills my heart till sometimes I think it's gonna explode. One time, <laughs> I made someone's head explode. Well, okay, maybe there's still a little hole. Actually, it happened four times. God, everybody at this camp, everybody at this camp has like deep-seated emotional issues, and they're all like seven. So I don't have any more accidents. Are you even listening to me, Dogen? I hope so. <laughs> okay, we should probably do this now. Maybe eventually. Somebody's crying. Okay. Nope. Which one is he in? Is he in this one up here? I think he is. Yep, the crying has gotten loud. Shut up! Oh, I, t I could totally get on top of this. I could totally get on top of this. Maybe not. Oh no, there's a thing up there! Ah, oh, I got it. I'm the best. You're welcome, kid. <laughs> what is this thing? It's a GPC, a geodesic psychoisolation chamber. Sounds sexy. Oh, man, cool. <laughs> Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Yeah. No, it's a six sensory deprivation tank, a hermetically sealed metaphysical hot box. It's solitary confinement for psychics. <laughs> Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. <laughs> threw me in here. You're welcome. Julian dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. <laughs> Perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hey, <laughs> Why is Russian kid obsessed with hairless bear? Fifty-nine arrowheads. 
Okay. I think I need to get out the button. Yep. Uh, button. How do I... How do I put it on there? There we go, I put the button on there. Ooh. <laughs> I'm here for the advanced training. All right, finally we're starting the advanced training. You don't say anything, man. Just stand there, like an asshole. Just don't don't say anything. Also, you have a tiny head because everybody else in this entire place has a gigantic head. I've been hearing a lot about head explosion. <laughs> Science, Rasputin. That is what we practice down here, not parlor tricks. If you are serious about exploring the possibilities of your mind, step up to the brain tumbler and we'll begin. Brain mm. tumbler? Sounds sexy. Okay, I'll step up to the brain tumbler. F. Which so, button is F? What's this hairdryer thing do? Ah, you're ready for the brain tumbler. <laughs> this device, we will send you deep into your own psyche. Where you should find unparalleled insight and power. Okay. Excellent. Tumble away. How do you put goggles on if you're going into your own brain? Not hurt, unless something really very bad happens. <laughs> yeah, I'm in a brain, my own brain. Wow. Is this what the inside of my mind looks like? Not yet. You're still traveling to the astral plane. <laughs> this is a tiny corner of what we call the collective unconscious, a place in which all of our unconscious minds are connected. You have just begun your training, Rasputin, so many of the connections with other minds are still not developed for you, and those okay. doorways right. remain just out of reach. But the nice. more you explore the mental world, the more connections you will form. Right now, the only unconscious world you can enter is that one, your own. Oh. Step through it, and we'll continue. All right, I will enter my own mind. Can I fall off? I cannot. That's that's a little bit disappointing. Can I jump off? I can. Oh shit. Oh, okay, it does nothing. Okay. So you can't just walk off, but there's like an invisible tiny fence and you can jump off. Whatever. Brain tumbler experiment. Yeah. Rasputin, can you hear me? No. Sasha where am I? He said you you're going into your own mind. Your own mind, but I'm not sure where. Tell me, what can you see? I see a rundown gypsy caravan. Do you recognize it? Yes. It's where I was born. I I'm a gypsy. Compelling. Ah, <laughs> oh, my own figments. Grab my own moving fucking figments. I wish they didn't move. Like honestly, I wish they didn't move. It just adds another level of tedium. Sasha, I'm going inside the caravan. What do you see inside? I'm not inside yet. I gotta kill this thing. Get back here. Thank you. All right. Uh, Rasputin's getaway. So I was part of a gypsy circus, and that's Rasputin, and that's what his normal hair looks like. And there's his beardy ass dad. And he reads the pamphlet about psychonauts, and he gets goggles, and his dad is strong as fuck somehow. That's cool. He has a big family. It's like, yeah, goddamn psychonauts. And his dad's like, no. And so he runs away, on a tiny, on a tiny, tiny horse. Raz, where'd you get a tiny horse? That's awesome, and it's so it's pissed off. Whispering rock, hitchhiked. Okay. So we got the memory. Nice. The teleporter, punch it. I go inside the caravan. I'm not sure. It's getting fuzzy. You like dags? Uh oh. What? No, I'll figure it out. No, I'm just gonna run in circles. Rasputin, tell me what is happening. Well, I'm kind of stuck in a little white space. Hmm. How little? Really little. Aha! Oh, I can break it! I didn't even know. Keep punching Rasputin. Oh, it's an egg. How Pavlovian. Rasputin, are you okay? 
What do you see now? Oh, the shit. A small, bunny like animal thing. Hmm. An unfamiliar animal entity in a dream often represents a primal fear or memory. Follow it, and it should lead you somewhere important. Check. Okay, Mr. Bun. You and I are gonna be tight. Wherever you go, I go. Like two peas in a hey! <laughs> Come back here! Little heart bunny. No, not yet. I wanna I wanna grab figments. Because they're fucking everywhere! And I'm gonna level up. Oh, there's a tag. I would have missed that. Curse tag. Man, Raz, you got crazy figments. The chicken brain, some skulls. There's meat. What is that? You tried to attack me? Fuck you. Ugh. Meat plants. Meat brain health, thank you. Uh, Sasha? What is it? Another bunny? No. This is more of a super scary flaming eyed demon kind of deal. <laughs> hmm. What? Okay, I'm pulling you out of there. Just give me a second. Uh, Sasha? Hold on, I'm still getting some unusual interference. It's fascinating. As if someone else... Agent 9? Sorry. Almost ready. Sasha! <laughs> There's the diver's helmet! I could have gotten that for the scavenger hunt. Come on, man. That should not have happened. We need to try that again. Oh. I don't think I need to be in the tumbler with the glowy eye guys anymore. <laughs> you know, in many tribal societies, learning to defeat the monsters you see in your dreams is considered a rite of passage. I can train you to fight. Come see me when you're ready. <laughs> defeat that big monster I saw. Okay. All right. Uh, I think I think I've recorded for long enough. Um, yeah, I guess next time we'll do more Sasha Nine shit. As always, uh, bye.